Hey, you guys, welcome to the I Am Bianca podcast show. Now, um, if you guys are a little bit confused on the stuff, now throughout the week, I will come on Spreaker and just have a regular talk. But on Saturdays, it's just the talk, like the podcast show. So let's talk about today. We're just going to be talking about Donald Trump, Robert De Niro, um, and stuff like that. So my favorite makeup item this week, and we have to get to the bell because the bell is the makeup item. The bell sounds means what is my favorite product for the week. So, let's get started. So, my favorite product is the OGX um, Cuckoo Oil um, Shampoo, Conditioner, and Oil. My next favorite product is the Revlon Flat Iron. And my next one is a makeup product, which is a... um, uh, I want to thank my grandparents for giving this to me. This is the um, Mineral Mineral Longevity Vivid Lip Lock Berry Kiss. I have a review for this. Um, I guess they got this as a free gift from something they got. So, they gave it to me. Um, So, let's talk Mr. Donald Trump here. So, earlier I was looking on Instagram and I saw a video of Robert De Niro. Now, Robert De Niro is one of my family's favorite actors, and I just looked on it, and I saw a video of him, and let me just play it. He's a con, a bullshit artist, a mutt who doesn't know what he's talking about, doesn't do his homework, doesn't care, thinks he's gaming society, doesn't pay his taxes. He's an idiot, Colin Powell said it best. He's a national disaster. He's an embarrassment to this country. It makes me so angry that this country has gotten to this point, that this fool Somebody that we want for president? I don't think so. What I care about is the direction of the country. And what I'm very, very worried about is that it might go in the wrong direction. Someone like Donald Trump. If you care about your future, vote for it. I mean, you're so blatantly stupid. Okay, so that is what Robert De Niro has said. Um. I agree with everything he has said. Just because Donald Trump is a bozo, he is dumb, he is stupid. And that is just my opinion. I'm I'm glad I'm not legal to vote yet, so I'm uh, I'm just glad. But um, it's just so stupid that somebody like Donald Trump can get this far in a league. Now, um, there was this a recording that came out about Donald Trump in 2005, and I want to play it. Hopefully, this is the right recording that I have, so let's just see. This contains graphic language. Yeah, that's right. Way to go. I don't know. 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 I
the store, they let you do it. You can do anything. Whatever you want. Grab by the pussy. <laughs> I can do anything. Oh, it looks good. Come on, Shorty. Ooh, that's nice. Get out of the way. Huh? Good. It's good if you don't fall out of the bus. Like Ford, get off Ford, you know? Is this what y'all want as a freaking president? Like, are you kidding me right now? Like, I don't get how people is voting for this man. I don't care if this was in 1988, 1968, 19, I mean, 2008, 2005, but this recording was in 2005, it said. And is this what y'all really want as a freaking president? If you are voting for him, I, I, I mean, I'm not going to take that back because that's your decision. That's who you are voting for. But at the same time, you're voting for this stupid bozo. I mean, it's just crazy. Like, I... I agree all in favor for Robert De Niro because it's just so crazy. Now, this is what Melina Trump has said. She has said, the words my husband used are unacceptable and offensive to me. This does not represent the man that I know. He has the heart and mind of a leader. I hope people will accept his apology as I have. Focus on important issues facing our nation and the world. Now, I don't really think she wrote this, and you know why, y'all remember, she didn't write this, she didn't write this, somebody else wrote this statement, people say she wrote it, but this is not her statement, somebody just wrote this just to be right in this, and this is just my opinion about Donald Trump, I would not trust Donald, I wouldn't, if you want to be honest, I would not trust my life on Donald Trump. I would not trust him with my family. I would not trust him anywhere. Um, his children can probably trust him. I just don't. I don't know the fool, but I mean, I'm not going to trust Donald Trump as president. I mean, I'm just really baiting for kind of Hillary because I always want a woman president. Um, and it's time for us to break that barrier of man being president all the time. We need a woman. So I'm here for Hillary Clinton, um, but I'm not that here for her. Um, Y'all get it. The reason why I'm not that here for her is because she, I just feel like a lot of people is taking advantage of the black vote. And I just want to make sure that our vote is you know, secure, you know, just make sure that we have a voice too. But. Some people, oh, sorry about the noise. Some people don't even care, so. Yeah, so that's all I'm going to talk about today is Donald Trump. Um, I hope you guys really like this um, thing. I'm a, um, first of all, um, I want to say thank you guys. I'm going to play the um, thing one more time. Bullshit artist. So I agree 100 percent with Robert De Niro. Um, do you agree with Robert De Niro on what he said about Donald Trump? Leave it in the comment section box below. And sorry about the language, what Donald Trump was saying. I just had to play it for you guys. So thank you guys for listening and tuning in. And let's get this video to some likes, some shares, some comments, and some subscribes. Alright, love you guys. See you next time.